Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. It's James and Jessica coming back at you from Brick It Out. Hey guys. Happy New Year, guys. Ooh. 2022 is officially here. So, pretty exciting. Get rid of the old year and start fresh with the new year. We hope you guys made all your New Year resolutions. We know we made ours. <laughs> <laughs> So we, um, it's been a while since we uploaded to the channel. I think it's been about three weeks since we posted a video, which is pretty long for us. Uh, we've had a lot going on. December was a crazy month and, um, you know, crazy end of the year. So got a bunch of stuff taken care of and uh, back on track now. So we're back to our regular scheduled program. Um, but we did go to the Lego store yesterday, January 1st. We waited in line. There's actually a couple hundred people in line. Yeah. It was quite a crowd um, for the new modular that came out as well as all the other amazing sets that they put out. So we picked up some decent sets and um, pretty decent little Lego haul here. So we're gonna jump right into this and show you guys what all we got. Okay, so first up on the list, as you guys can already guess, we picked up the new modular, the Boutique Hotel. Of course. Uh, this is set number 10297. It's an 18 plus set, 3,066 pieces. And this is the 15 year anniversary of the modular building collection. So as you can see, that's, uh, that's a beautiful set. Um, I wasn't, at first I wasn't quite sure how I felt about them having this side open here. I kind of thought if it's a hotel, maybe they should make it this length, kind of like the assembly square mm -hmm. with more room. I'm gonna put some rooms over here, but this actually looks pretty cool here, you know, with a little tree and you got the little um, art gallery there. So we're anxious to build this. Uh, this set comes with, it looks like it comes with seven minifigures. Um, you know, Boutique Hotel is pretty neat. Kind of like the old Cafe Corner, which we still don't have. Uh, it's pretty expensive now, but you see how it fits in here between the um, police station and the uh, bookshop there. Uh, of course, you can display them however you like. So this retails for $199.99 here in the United States, and uh, we're, we're happy to get this. We'll slide this over here. You guys can take a look at that. Next up on the list, this is something that we missed the first time around, and that is set number 71395. This is the Super Mario 64 block, um, 18 plus set as well. 2,064 pieces, 64 for 64, I guess, for Mario. Um, this brings back a lot of, you know, childhood memories and playing Mario, staying up late at night. Mm -hmm. um, I love how it opens up and you can, it has all the different worlds there. I think there's four different worlds there, plus the little hidden compartment down at the bottom. So, like I said, this is definitely not a January 1st, 2022 release set, but it is a new set for us because it's something that we missed on the last order. So, um, we'll slide them over here. Put the boutique hotel there. Hope you guys can see all that in the frame. Uh, next up, here's another set that we missed from the last time around, and this is the another 18 plus set, set number 10290, which is the awesome pickup truck. This set retails for $119.99. I'm sorry, $129.99 in the United States. Oh, and the block retails for $169.99, also in the United States. So, uh, of course, you know, different countries will have different prices, but that's what it is here in the United States. This set is 1,677 pieces. Uh, we actually saw this on display at the Lego store when we were there yesterday, and this thing looks big and just beautiful. We had to get it. Uh, I wish we would have got it before. But you can see the back of the box here. Little Christmas wreath there, the flowers they put in, and uh, you got your little pumpkins and apples and stuff, little fruit baskets. Pretty cool how you put the different side walls on the uh, the bed of the truck back there. Yeah, so we're excited about this one to build as well. We're always excited about Lego sets. Okay, so we'll move that over there. Okay, now this next set here was one that we actually forgot about. And to our surprise, we saw they had one left at the Lego store. And this set is now officially retired. In fact, I think it retired last month. And that is... Official Lego set number 10277, the Crocodile Locomotive. This was a set that we never got. We were sorry we didn't get it. Retailed for 19, I'm sorry, for $99.99 was a retail price. However, when we picked this up at Lego yesterday, it was on sale for $79.99. We talked to the lady, the manager, and she said, yeah, this set is definitely officially retired. They actually found this in the back. It was kind of hidden in the back somewhere, so we just lucked out. We happened to be there 
we were one of the first people in the store. We were outside waiting early. Just happened to get this, so that's really awesome that we got that set. Mm -hmm. we got this set here. This is 1,271 pieces, um, 18 plus, and we're really excited to build this. Uh, Lego trains always do well. I think there's a function, yeah, you can motorize it too. It has a different functions and stuff there to motorize it, the power up functions. So, yeah. Another one's gonna go on a display shelf at some point. And then next up, we picked up this set. This is a cute little set. It's a city set, set number 60327, which is the horse transporter. Um, 196 pieces, retails for $29.99 here in the United States. Comes with two minifigures, the horse and the puppy there. Uh, that's a pretty cool little set. January 1st release set as well. You can see the back of the box there. Yeah, just a really cool little set. There's a ton of sets coming out mm -hmm. that, that that were out, and obviously we couldn't get we could only get so many, but um, definitely was a fun little trip. All right, got a couple more small things here for you guys. We picked up 404, I'm sorry, 40543, which is the Saint Bernard Brickhead set, the two pack. This is 14.99 here in the United States. Comes with a total of 236 pieces, and it's an eight plus set. There was four different Brickhead sets that came out for January 1st. They were scheduled to be released on January 1st. And for some weird reason, on legoshop.com and at the Lego store we went to, this was the only one that was available. There was another puppy, the, the French Bulldog, yep. or Bullhound, I believe. There was a two-pack of that that wasn't there. Also, the Ahsoka 150th anniversary set. Uh, 150th Brickhead, not anniversary, but yeah. Brickhead set. Uh, that wasn't there not online or in the store and then that lion dancing guy he wasn't there either mm -hmm. so we were pretty disappointed if you guys watched our channel if you're if you're you know definitely have seen other videos you'll know that brick heads are our favorite thing to build um we just love them. we always have and we were disappointed only to get one out of four you know so i don't know what's going on with that if it's just a north america stock thing or Leave a comment below if you guys don't live in America and you guys were able to get these sets at January 1st. We'd be curious to know. Yeah. All right, next up we picked up, this is a cute little set here. 40522, which is the Valentine Lovebirds. I actually didn't even know this set was available, did you? No, I didn't until you showed me. Exactly, but we saw this at the uh, Lego store. So cute. And this is $12.99 for this set. You get 298 pieces, which is just great you know yeah. this kind of set's going to sell out really fast there and it looks like they have another set coming down see that with the rabbits Aww. the 40523 so we'll have to keep a lookout for that as well yeah. uh 12.99 for that you can't beat that guys that is available on lego.com or in the uh store that we went to and then the last set that we got but certainly not least exactly <laughs> is set number 75321 this is the razor crest micro fighter um Ten dollars for this set, of course, ninety-eight pieces. There's no little Grogu in there. It's just, it's just the Mandalorian. But you can see the back of it there. It's a pretty neat little build, from what I can see. We might be building this one tonight. Um, so that's pretty much it, guys. We just picked up the. So you got the crocodile locomotive, the pickup truck, the block, and then the big beautiful ho uh, boutique hotel, the horse transporter, the microfighter Razor Crest, the Valentine Lovebirds, and the. Um, only one out of four of the Brickhead sets. So not a bad haul. It was definitely over $700, $750, I believe, yeah. for this. So um, please leave a comment below. We'd love to hear from you guys. Uh, yeah, sorry it took us so long to put a video up. I know it's been at least three weeks, but we've had a really crazy month. Um, we appreciate you guys' support. If you guys have any questions, please comment below. Please let us know what sets you guys picked up for your January 1st to ring in your new year at the Lego store or legoshop.com. Thanks again for watching. Stay tuned, and we will see you guys right back here in the next video.